says you can't have it all? Not Appalachian Wireless. We know what you want. Appalachian Wireless offers the hottest smartphones and unlimited data plans, all on the region's number one network. As anticipation builds for the Pikeville Farmers Market this weekend, organizers of the WIC and Senior Voucher Giveaway spent the day with Kentucky Agriculture Commissioner Ryan Quarles. Starting tomorrow, the Pike County Health Department will be handing out WIC fruit and veggie vouchers to be used at various Kentucky farmers markets. The vouchers can be used for fresh produce for anyone over five months old and already enrolled in the WIC program. It's so important that people help take care of themselves by eating healthy and that means buying Kentucky Proud. And so we're very proud to know that Pikeville has a high utilization rate of both WIC and the seniors, seniors farmers market. Only participants who receive WIC from the Pike County Health Department in Pikeville will be eligible for the vouchers given out tomorrow and Friday. Farmers with the Pikeville Farmers Market will be at the Health Department tomorrow to offer a pop-up market. The Kentucky Department of Ag, along with some other agencies in Frankfurt, help administer some of these government programs. And in particular, the Department of Agriculture administers the Double Dollars program, where uh, those who qualify can go to a farmer's market and actually buy twice as much produce with the same spending power. Those registered for WIC at the Pike County Health Department in Belfry will be able to pick up vouchers at the Belfry location on July 19th and 20th. Those who utilize these programs are making a proactive step to help better their health. And whenever you eat better, uh, it helps prevent issues down the road. And so we're happy that Pikeville continues to be a role model community when it comes to utilizing these programs. Saturday, the Pikeville Farmers Market will be distributing vouchers for qualifying senior citizens. In Pikeville, Shelby Porter, EKB News.